One good thing about music is that when it hits you, you feel no pain. Bob Marley sang, and the Deputy Prime Minister has no objection in Western Province. The rhythm arrest is also doing the rounds down in the coast. <laughs> And in the central region as well. Do I hear anyone complaining? Now, now, why can one not want to be part of the merrymaking? <laughs> and if that is the case, then what were you doing here? Maybe we need to be reintroduced. Najua mimi. Sikuju. Eh. Ah. Mimi naitwa William Ruto. Mimi ni waziri wa kilimo. Eh, mwaje kusikia. Sita sikia ko. Familiar or not, the country's agriculture done was not finding sweet tales in Zoia. Miaka 5. Oh yes. Nambona haijakunwa. Sasa <laughs> The honorable man probably has a point, but so does the agriculture boss. And it has to do with unsolicited gift tokens. If the Nzoia management wanted the agriculture don's attention, would the direct approach have been any better? <laughs> But uh, I am not interested. We have a lot of mud cans here, and even if Kibaki retires, if the mud cans are, have lined themselves to take over from him, and that creates a visual circle, you know, of leadership. If you understand what the Kotudon means, that is what our politics has been reduced to. But it somehow drives the country. What with another inquiry report in the bag? If you say nobody won, then the next 2012, then we will fight, bring confusion, nobody wins, we go and share the positions in the government. Commissions of inquiry are clearly not music to the ears of the court boss. Now this is the kind of music for the long time CBK operative now shunted aside. I take a lot of encouragement from Bob Mali when he tells us, when one door is closed, don't you know, many more are open. When one door is closed, don't you know, another is open. But don't you get the feeling that some of these doors of opportunity seem to be the preserve of a selected few? I need President Kibaki or whoever will be president to appoint my son as ambassador as whatever because of the contribution I've done for this country. If that is the case, then more public servants should then be dedicated in discharging their duties. Not exactly exemplified by the dawn of the country, but the man behind the boss who does not even have the luxury of blinking regularly. Across the border, that kind of dedication, I beg to point out, is prone to the natural tendencies of losing concentration and not just blinking, but grabbing a whole 40 winks. If the unexpected happens to happen, much more than a dedicated explanation will suffice here. 
and the unexpected does happen. <laughs> David killed Goliath with a sling and a stone. Samson killed the Philistines with a donkey jawbone. But who would have thought that spiritual warfare can be unleashed on fellow believers? <laughs> Albert Kashiri, Bullseye, NTV.